The lawsuit filed by Julia Mesley, 65, alleges that Steven Tyler, 74, used his fame as Aerosmith frontman to groom, manipulate, exploit, and sexually assault her over three years in the 1970s, when she was 16 and he was in his 20s. Mr. Tyler was initially kept anonymous in a lawsuit that was filed last month. However, Los Angeles County Superior Court provided legal approval to name him on Wednesday. In court documents seen by Entertainment Weekly, it says that Ms. Mesley met Mr. Tyler in 1973 when she was invited backstage at an Aerosmith concert and later to his hotel room. Ms. Mesley accuses Mr. Tyler of sexually abusing her that night and again in another hotel room after Aerosmith's next concert in Seattle, where he allegedly flew her out to attend. Ms. Mesley also claims that the musician met with her mother the following year and convinced her to sign over the guardianship of her daughter to him, assuring her of her well-being. The complaint continues that Mr. Tyler, did not meaningfully follow through on these promises and instead continued to travel with, assault and provide alcohol and drugs, to Ms. Misley. He is also accused of getting her pregnant and coercing her to get an abortion. The suit also says that Mr. Tyler's 2004 memoir imposed involuntary infamy on Ms. Misley because it discussed his relationship with a minor while framing it as a romantic, loving relationship. Ms. Misley was also named in a 1976 Rolling Stone article which said she was always nearby, trailing in her wistfully towering way off his arm like a scarf. Ms. Misley is seeking an unspecified amount of compensation and a trial. In a statement, she said, I want this action to expose an industry that protects celebrity offenders. To cleanse and hold accountable an industry that both exploited and allowed me to be exploited for years, along with so many other naive and vulnerable kids and adults. She added that the complaint recites in legal terms the trajectory of my life from early struggles to exploitation by Steven Tyler, the music industry, my escape from that world, my recovery and transformation, my restoration of spirit through faith, the building of a family and the rebuilding of my life. Ms. Misley continued that she is grateful for this new opportunity to take action and be heard. Her attorney, Jeff Anderson, added, This industry, and these defendants have permitted, protected, and profited from severe violence for decades. It's time to face the music. It's time for reckoning. Now, adult survivors of sexual abuse can act under the California Child Victims Act, giving voice and power to adult victims of assault. Express.co.uk has contacted Steven Tyler's representatives for comment.